Hi I am Eva from Mini Orange. In this video, I am going to show you how you can secure your Cisco AnyConnect VPN using Mini Orange MFA solution. Mini Orange provides 15 plus MFA methods like OTP over SMS or email, SMS with link, push notifications, Google Authenticator, Microsoft Authenticator, hardware tokens, phone callback, Mini Orange soft token, and many more. These are easy to set up and do not require any external proxy to be installed on top of your VPN servers. In addition to the 15 plus MFA methods, Mini Orange also provides risk based authentication, which is authentication based IP restriction and authentication based on time of access. We also provide restrictions on the basis of user attributes, like groups, etc. Additional features, like radius accounting and radius auditing, are also included in the Mini Orange feature stack. First, we will add Cisco AnyConnect as a Radius client in Mini Orange. Then we will configure Mini Orange as a Radius server in Cisco. At last we will test the MFA login for Cisco AnyConnect. In the customization section, you have full control over the user experience for sign-up and authentication flow. Look and feel of the login or sign-up page. End user portal dashboard customization. Branding. Internationalization. RTL support. Vanity URL and many more. To set up branding, first, go to the customization section. Enter your company's subdomain name or any other name of your choice. Here you can manage the UI aspects of the layout and set up your own dashboard look. After that save the settings. You have successfully set up the branding. Now let's go to the Mini Orange Admin dashboard and set up the Cisco as a Radius client. Now to add the Cisco AnyConnect, go to the App section from the left menu bar. To add an application, click on the Add Application button. Now find the Radius section, and then click on the Create App. Now search for the Cisco AnyConnect application. Fill in all the basic information. Enter the client name of your choice. Enter client IP address. It is the public IP address of the VPN server. Enter shared secret. It is a common password between Mini Orange and VPN server. Copy and save the Radius server IPs, which will be required to configure your Radius client. You can also enable the two-factor authentication from here. And save the settings. You have successfully set up the application in Mini Orange. Now let's go to the Cisco AnyConnect to set up Mini Orange's Radius server. First, log in to Cisco ASA via ASDM. Then navigate to the Configuration tab in the top left corner, then click on the Remote Access VPN in the bottom left corner. In the Remote Access VPN navigation tree, under the AAA Local Users, click AAA Server Groups, and then click Add. The Add AAA Server Group dialog box opens. Enter a name for the AAA Server Group, and set the protocol to Radius. You can keep the dead time as 10 minutes, and max failed attempts as 3. And then click OK. Now in the AAA Server Groups panel, select the server group that you just created. And then from the right-hand side, click Add. The Add AAA Server dialog box opens. Select the interface name as outside from the drop-down. Enter the server name or IP address that you copied from the Mini Orange dashboard. You can set the timeout as 60 seconds. Make sure that server authentication port is set as 1812 and server accounting port is set as 1813. In the server secret key, paste the secret key that you copied from the Mini Orange dashboard. Make sure that Microsoft Chat V2 capable checkbox is unchecked. And then click OK. Now navigate to the client SSL VPN access and then connection profiles. From the connection profiles, click on Add. The Add Clientless SSL VPN Connection Profile dialog box opens. Add a relevant server name and aliases. Choose the authentication method to be AAA. For the AAA server group, select the group made in the earlier steps. And then click OK. You have successfully set up the Mini Orange as the Radius server in Cisco AnyConnect. Now let's test the MFA login to your Cisco AnyConnect with Mini Orange Radius server. Open your Cisco AnyConnect client. Enter your username and password. You will be prompted again for 2FA. Enter your 2FA code based on your chosen method, and then submit. You should now be connected to the VPN upon validation of credentials. 
Amazing work guys. Now you know how to set up the mini orange as the radius server in Cisco AnyConnect. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, drop us a query at info at securify.com for any other questions.